Okay. Today is our June favorite video. So it's July. <laughs> Damn it. Hey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi guys. Um so today is our July favorite. July. <laughs> July. <laughs> July favorites. Um we have a variety of uh, makeup products as yes, well as skincare. Could say so myself. We have a bit of a meh product, but we have also the good product. So let's start with your favorite thing last night. I'm gonna start? Yes, you really think. Okay. So, um, a few days ago, weeks ago, we're not sure. She we uploaded not. our fresh summer look. And there I used the L'Oreal Nude, <laughs> Nude Magic Cushion Foundation. Um, I like using a cushion foundation in summer because it's very dewy, it's very light coverage, just covers the bare minimum. Sorry, Thank God. Um, the bare minimum, basically. Um, basically. Bye, Isaac. Bye, Isaac. I'm saying it's girl. I haven't said it in a while. I'm 10. So. I'm 10. She's 10. I'm 10. Can you stop, girl? I'm, I'm going to use the bronze and water on you. Is it on me? Okay. Um, this is in the shade. Probably light ass bitch because <laughs> I'm always the lightest shade. I think it it's fair though. It should have. It should be fair. I think, I think it's, it's fair. fair. It's fair. It's and it says dewy glow foundation by L'Oreal. Has a mirror. Has a poofy poof. What do you call this? A sponge. 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 Mm -hmm. sponge. I call it a poofy poof. And we have your cutting foundation. What I like about oh, nice. it is because it's compact. Very yeah, It's your old school foundation. Where are you there? Mm -hmm, I like it. I really do want it. Where's the real deal? Is it expensive to buy? This. Mm, if you don't remember, sorry for the question. 12, 13 euros, maybe something oh, yeah. like that. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. It was good. I mean, it's Loria, so. It's good. I like it. I like it very much. Okay, my turn. Bye. <laughs> so, I'll be talking to you about the setting powder of Wet n Wild. It is a very good press powder. Compact. Um, uh, I hit pan, so why? Do I have um, mine? Probably have my. Oh, you have mine. You have yours as well. It's not um, fair, but I hit pan as well. I like its formula. It's very good, you know. I, I found it. I found it really good, you know. I found a really. I found it to be a very good addition. Are you okay? I found that it is a very good addition to my makeup routine. Um, I don't really have much to say about it. Just that it really works for me. You're so for another one. And I'm due for As another one. And it was five euros or six euros. Four ninety nine. Yes. Four ninety nine. There, John. Four three. Yeah. At that. first, because this is so much bigger. Ah, cheap is like because it's don't, it's like a don't don't, uh, don't, 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 don't shape. Don't. And when I started seeing the black, I was like, because mm? I didn't think that it was gonna be oh Vera. It's a bit. Uh, it's, 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 the packaging is a bit. It different. tricks you. Hey. It tricked me because when I saw that it was dawn, I was like, oh, I have more product. And I started hitting pan, and I was seeing this black come through. And usually it's matted when you hit pan. That was there, but then I realized, girl, you can it's, it's good. good. It's good. Um, keeping good up I with setting good. powders, I just realized mine are all drugstore today. <laughs> Yours aren't, girl. No way, I have we yet. So, okay. 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 So, um. I've been using the Rimmel London Match Perfection Powder. This is a translucent is powder. That, is that good? I do like it. Um, it doesn't flash back because it's kind of, look at the color. It's like a pearl pinky color. Mm -hmm. It's not white, so it doesn't flash back. A few months ago, I think in our very first one, we had mentioned the Catrice powder, the which we you. hated. We still have it. We have two, one each. Type of Rimmy. We don't like it, honestly, because it's it's dry in it. It's not good. And so I found this at the drugstore and I like it. It's very nice. And to be honest with you, I was I went in there to look for the Maybelline one. Because the Fit Me powder is very, very well hyped. Mm -hmm. It's in a square. Um however when I spoke to the lady who was at Lucy Makeup Store, uh, she told me that in water we don't get the the fit me, the maybe the fit me. She told me I know which one it is because I really want it, but we don't stock it. Because? Because Malta, not Anyway, 
And you know me, this is, this is very well hyped. It's a close second to the Fit Me. And I tried it out, and it's really good, and I really like it. Price wise, I don't know how much it was, but it's really so it's affordable. I can't understand why certain products don't come to that. I like, like foundation shades, man. Foundation shades, they go her out. I mean, oh yeah. It pisses me off. In fact, you only find four foundation shades. Not, uh, We're a very diverse country, as is now everywhere else, as the whole world. Especially now that there are. There's more to, there are more foreigners in motor working and not just working, just even living here. Yes, light, light skin tones, dark skin tones, yellow skin tones. This is this is the powder that we didn't like in Kashi's. Abiat Karti, Flashback City. You can um, go back to our March favorites, I think it's there. Yes, it is. Um, it's not a favorite. It's a um, what you're talking about, the foundation shades. I'm from my Mediterranean heritage. But, uh, I'm pale. I'm very pale. The lightest foundation, many times, it's too dark for me. I have to either mix it with a concealer or just find something online. Which, which is sucks. Really which sucks. But sometimes, most of the time, when I buy a foundation online, it's not my shade. Because I can't really match. Which. Oh. Yeah, you know, such a problem. Which is Mediterranean skin tone. No, but it doesn't make sense. I mean, yeah, it's just for it doesn't. I mean, many. Many brands you find very light ones and you don't find dark ones. Yeah, or the other way around. For example, I can tell you this. I'm not gonna show you what it was up. This is the lightest Revlon foundation, the Insta filter. It's too dark for me. And they only have four shades. They only have four shades in Malta. In Malta. In Malta. This is too dark for me. I mean Emsta Mel. Yeah. 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 Yuriash, very sun. Yes, yes, yes. And yes. um, as you can see for yourself, when applied, it is in a spray type. Okay, it smells wonderful, and it it is a transparent type of color. For sense, man, do the club yet cloggy that when you rub and rub and rub, it's like it's still there, you know. Um, and it also has a very nice and different. It has a nice refreshing. Um, um, factor to it to be fair for sense of on application, which I like it, man. I like the smell. I like it, man. I like it. Thank you, Yuri. Mm -hmm. As for price wise, it's a it it is around twenty two euros. Like um, bear in mind that when you're buying some blog, the more expensive they are, obviously the better. The better. They are. <laughs> so um, uh, I would Everything say that this is a very as a, this is a very reasonable price to go for. So. I would keep it in mind if you need to purchase your next um, uh, your next one. Um, I'll be showing you my favorite after sun in my so August favorites for sure. I like that it's dry. It's not exactly. It's that much like cloggy so on the top of it. That it smells and it smells beautiful. And fifty SPF fifty plus fifty plus fifty plus important half now. So. Thank you. Well done on the SPF girl. Thank you. Um, I have uh, a palette. It's a blush palette, not an eyeshadow palette. Sorry. I don't know if it's still available. I remember that. I have one like that. But, you do? But a bit of a darker shade. All right. Um, I'm not sure if it's still available. It's from Essence. It is the Blush Play Sculpting Blush Palette. I don't know how blush can be sculpting, to be honest. You have it here? Oh, look at that girl. Look at that. Anyway, um, let's see. Mine is in the shade plain peach, and I love peach blushes. You have it just about it. I have it somewhere, but I don't know where it is. I don't, I don't know where it is. Somewhere. Um, it has a sculpt shade, uh, the fine shade, and the highlight shade. I use them all for blushes or blush toppers, to be honest. I don't, I don't sculpt with a blush. I don't know about you. You don't sculpt with a brush. With a blush? Do you sculpt contour? No. Exactly. You don't even use blush. How do you have this palette if you don't use blush? Because it was given to me as a present and I didn't, um, I, I don't use it as much. I should just give it to you, to be fair. Give it to me, girl. I'll find it. I know it's Anyway, nice. Blooch. I am a huge fan of Blooch, if you don't know. And she, even the way she, how she says it, it's Blooch. It's not blush. It's blush. Right? It's Blooch. Get with times, guys. Yes. 
Um, I mostly use Sorry. these two shades and I mix them together. But sometimes I do like to use the highlight shade also. So highlight shade. Yeah, that's the highlight. That. Wow. That's all you got. No, that's the highlight. Isn't it? The scalp is a bit meh meh, but I mean, got it some up. Yeah, it's obvious. Can you see? Can you see pretty mm. goals? There they are. I love the colors, guys. And the peach blushes are my favorite kind of colors for my cheeks. I, seeing as I'm so pale, I don't really like a bright pink. I don't think I actually, actually like bright pink on anyone. I don't. On some people, it might look cute, but I, don't, I, I prefer peach. I don't. I like peach blushes. Plus, I have a peach blush over here and a peach blush over here. I don't know why I have so many peach blushes because I always go to the same color. Mm -hmm. She's still looking for her blush. I'm still looking for it. I'm still at the IVF. I'm still at the IVF. Damn it. Home. It could be at home. It's not sensible. I do. Damn it. Anyway, Sorry, it's a cute please. palette. That was very affordable, of course, because it's Essence. I'm not sure if it's still available. Tough shit, man. <laughs> but I like it. It's nice. So, <laughs> if you have it, or if you find it, maybe Amazon might have it. Go for it. I love it. Because I said so, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, I have a statement. Becky and I. No, we still have another one. Okay, Jay. Sorry, so. I thought we were going to go for the Meh Meh one, so what if she has a favorite? I have another favorite, guys. Um, shut up, Thea. I can see you through the camera, man. Okay. Bougie AF. Bougie. Bougie. It's all. But this I have to mention because it is one of my favorites and it is the kind of thing that you would only wear when you're going out, going out, okay? And you're tatty. <laughs> and you're tatty. <laughs> Jeffrey, stop. Yeah. Um, it is the Guerlain Gold 24 Karat Gold Primer. Yes. Of course you can. My God, I think. I didn't buy it myself. Um, my my boyfriend bought it for me during Christmas. He bought he me makeup. Stay, stay. He bought me makeup. I wish mine would buy me makeup in every day. Okay, thanks, <laughs> girl. But this is a twenty-four karat gold primer, um, and I say it because it really it doesn't have much of a smell. Yes, it does. Yeah, yeah, mom, just like that. I would. I mention it because you can hold it. <laughs> oh my I mention it because um, as a material, Mela, let's start from there. As a material, it is runny in the sense that it's not you know like mm -hmm. blobby. Okay. It's runny. It's, it has a nice these words though. Runny, 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 blobby, runny. blobby and runny. <laughs> but am I making sense? You are. You are. I'm understanding okay, you. I know what you mean. Um, anyway, the yeah. consistency, the consistency, uh -huh. yeah, very soft and like easy to apply on the face, which okay. is very good. And right. after some minutes, and you should try it out one time or another, it tightens the skin. That's what it they does. say. That's it what does. They say. Yeah. Um, and you, you really do feel it. You know, like you don't just put primer on your face and that's it. Part perfection, top benefit. You uh -huh. do feel that there's something on your face that it is going to make a difference. And this does make okay. a difference. So. But I don't think they're different. I mean, they're different. They're not the same. They're different. They're not the same. But so, these are pore filling, and this is probably moisturizing. Moisturizing, yeah. Is moisturizing, go and so much. Radiant. Oh, radiant. Oh, radiant. Go the. <laughs> Sorry, that was a break for it. Sorry, thanks. Was oh, she cute? Thanks. It's all the manners. <laughs> With the cliche. I mean, that's a big talent. It's just. I like it. And the price tag. And the price tag. Obviously, I didn't buy it myself, so I don't know the price. I know the price. I'm not going to tell you. I know the price. I've been wanting to so I'll, oh, Okay, I looked for it. I'm like, <gasps> back. <laughs> I'll buy it again. What are you doing? Well, oh, no. I mean, you've had it for quite a while now, and it's still uh, I have, but going it's strong. because I don't want to use. I mean, you know, you have those products that you don't want to use, but you want to I use. Know, and, you, you know, so I use it when I really go out and like it's a nice evening out much like patata malar which we don't do anymore for a gala dinner yeah. for a gala dinner you know we have to put in people to for a set for makeup yeah. events which we don't do no because we're not invited as well there you go and now we have two meh meh products um, for those of you who don't know meh meh means shit 
<laughs> okay, that was very explicit, but yes, she's right. Um, for my disappointing product of this month, I have an eyeliner from Catrice, which is called the Rock Couture Liquid Liner. It says that it's 24 hours. It didn't last the night. What? And a night is not 24 hours. Oh, it's not enough one. It's not so, uh uh. Um, and secondly, I think this is my fault though. Um, I don't like a shiny black liner when it dries down. I like it to be matte, like how we were nice. Matte. matte. This, shine, this, this dry is very, very shiny. But how I can, how, you know, I, I never used a shiny mascara. Like liner, girl. Liner, sorry. It already shows that it's shiny. I mean, the pigment is there. It's not, it, it's, it's not actually. It's nice. The liner is nice, but it dries shiny. And I don't, look, see, it's drying here and it's shiny. Mm -hmm. I like it matte. Like I'm not gonna go over with an eyeshadow to make it matte. That's it. Because the liner, it dries matte. It's got it. I don't like it. See, but it says vinyl on it, so probably it's fine. <laughs> if I'm if you don't, if I'm, that it's in a shade vinyl lipstick. <laughs> I still wear it, man, but obviously you're really too restrictive to, from everything. doing anything, because even talking. Because even talking, yeah, it just runs on your teeth. Emma, that's pretty much it. Yes, that's the end of the story, guys. <laughs> that's the end of the anyway, story, but I'm worried. It, I can't say it's bad because of the pigment or the brush, because they're both good. It's just I don't like a shiny eyeliner. Plus, that is. It, uh, it's not long lasting. It says that it is, and it's not. So. Yeah. Yeah. What do you teach? End of story. I feel bad talking shit about products. I swear to you. Mine is. To be fair, they're not known for makeup, so I wouldn't have imagined that obviously their makeup would work. But there mm -hmm. are some. They, they really have good perfumes that they have the brand that we're going to talk about now. And uh, they have really nice. Smelly perfumes, smelly, smelly in a good way. Um, in my under eye makeup line, the home special mental lipsticks H and M. By the way, guys, this is H and M. Sorry, I should have mentioned before. Um, H and M have a line of cosmetics as well, and they have these um, matte lipsticks, as so they claim, and they are matte. But the thing is, when they dry, even now seeing the the, I don't know if you can see it yourself. Like you can see that it is. It doesn't look very. It's. At the time it looked nice because um, the color is a wine burgundy color, which I love. But when I put it on my lips after, obviously, I bought it. Because you don't do that before, that's nasty. Stop doing it, okay? <laughs> I don't like people experimenting with makeup, which obviously is going to be bought by others. Like, can you please use a sample? Thank you. Um, uh, and so on. Look at it neat. Only it dries down too matty. Matty, Matty. I like that, Matty. Is that it? I'm not going to tell you color and like your lip. Yeah, that's that kind of. Your lip, you can see your lip. You have like a semicircle. Exactly. And you try, you attempt to try and refill it again, and it looks even patchier, so don't do it. Yes, I don't know. So th that's what really happened. So I don't really use it anymore. Can I like it? 10, 10 pounds down to If you want to try and switch it also on your. Okay, I kid her not, but she meant it. The color is nice, but the color is nice. It's not my kind of color, it's your kind of color. No, no, so we have now, I just, I kid her not, application to you. It's just, I wasn't expecting much from H&M, as in, from the cosmetic line. H&M, lipsticks, that's really lovely. Terja? She does. I don't like this, huh? I know, for a fact, she has a mood. I don't know about these kinds of colors. Emma, could it have been like... Maybe it's different. Maybe the formula is different. I think the formula is different because I did not like this. And I'm sure she tries it. Vanitas. 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 I think it's Vanitas, but yes. But I will say Vanitas. Vanitas. Vanita chiquita bonita. That's pretty much it. Emma, I didn't like it. I'm very sorry. But I don't throw it away because I love the color. Girl. We're not in the house. We're not in the house. But how do you have a budget? It's going to expire, girl. Just bye. Anyway. So, guys, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I like that. 
She told me to put a bit of more sass to it. More dramatic for me. More dramatic was what I said to you. And that. That's how I know you did it right. <gasps> oh. And hit the bell so you know when we upload every Tuesdays and Saturdays. You go, girl. On the jet ass, I'm in the glass. Remember when I hurt my neck? That's how I look at you. You know it's evening, right? <coughs> anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs> we'll see you in our next video. Bye.